Sufis of St. Augustine of Hippo, also known as St. Augustine, who was born on 13th November 354 AD in Tagasta, the Roman province of Numidia. His father, Patricius, was a pagan who converted to Christianity on his deathbed and his mother, Monica, was a great devoted Christian. Augustine was a brilliant student with an eager intellectual curiosity. At the age of 11, he became familiar with Latin literature as well as pagan beliefs and practices. His first insight into the nature of sin occurred when he and a number of friends stole the fruit they did not want from a neighborhood garden. They stole the fruit not because they were hungry, but because it was not permitted. At the age of 70, he went to Carthage to continue his education. In spite of the good warnings of his mother, Augustine lived a hedonistic lifestyle for a time. Initially, Augustine was not strongly influenced by Christianity and its ideologies. But after coming in contact with Ambrose, Augustine re-evaluated himself and forever changed. In late August, at the age of 31, just reading the life of Antony of Desert, Augustine converted to Christianity. As Augustine later told, his conversion was prompted by hearing a child's voice say, Take up and read. Then he opened a book of St. Paul's writing at random and reads Romans chapter 13, verses 13 to 14. Not in writing and drunkenness, not in chambering and wantonness, not in strife and envy, but put on Lord Jesus Christ and make no provision for the flesh to fulfill the lust thereof. Reading the scripture, Augustine felt his heart was flooded with light and he turned totally from his sin. Later on, Bishop Ambrose baptized Augustine. In 391, Augustine was ordained a priest in Hippo Regis. He became a famous preacher then. He spent his final days in prayer and repentance, requesting the penitential psalms of David. And finally, he died on August 28, 430. And later on, he was canonized and recognized as the doctor of the church on 1298 by Pope Boniface VIII. Now, he is considered as a patron of breivers, printers and theologians. We may pray through his intercession. We may abandon evil and increase in virtue. Amen. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Saint John the Baptist, pray for us. Saint Peter, pray for us. Saint Say